Hi friends, I am sure every household will have wall spaces which are not being utilized properly. In my house too, there are some spaces which have not been used. In this video, I am showing how I have used two such spaces. So this is where I keep my dishwasher and washing machine and I have got a lot of free space in this room. So this uh, free wall space here I wanted to make use of and hence I shifted the water purifier from the kitchen to this place uh, because it needs very little space and I also have the habit of filling uh, water in bottles and storing them. So for that the Algot gave me a perfect solution. So you can see I made two shelves for storing water bottles and even glasses. I have fixed uh, this uh, wall uprights at a gap of 40 centimeters because the available space was only this much. For this I needed a small wall upright of 56 centimeters where I am able to keep two metal shelves and uh, which can hold uh, so many bottles, glass bottles as well as plastic bottles and this metal stand can withstand up to a weight of 10 kgs each. So this is 40 centimeters and 18 centimeters depth. The same kind of shelf, metal shelf, uh, 18 centimeter deep and uh, 60 centimeter wide. I have already shown in my earlier Algot video which I have shown uh, being used for my laundry storage. So you get these shelves in uh, three sizes, that is three widths, that is uh, 40, 60 and 80 centimeters wide. Uh, we could use a shelf width of 40 centimeters with a depth of 18 centimeters and because there are uh, four brackets and two shelves and uh, two uh, wall uprights, it cost uh, 1100 rupees. You can see the description of this video and you will get more details. This is one more wall space which was never uh, used. Here again we have made use of the Algot storage organizer. This being a passage, only small space of the wall could be utilized and hence the small Algot. So here we have made a small shoe organizer for all those uh, extra pairs of shoes which did not have place in our regular shoe shelf. For this we have used two 56 cm long wall uprights two shoe organizers and four small brackets to fit these. The total cost came to 1100 rupees. You can see the description for the detailed breakup. Each of these shoe organizer can hold uh, up to three pairs of uh, shoes, large ones. So you can see that in these two shoe organizers, I've placed uh, six pairs of shoes. These are the brackets. They can be fitted anywhere in the wall upright in the given slots. You can see that it is very easy to uh, fit and remove them. So once the brackets are fitted, you can place any accessory on those brackets. But here uh, I've used only the shoe organizer. Anytime I feel like I can remove and uh, fit any other accessory which can be used for storing any other items. Now I am going to explain the Algot uh, planner. So I will explain how we designed the shelves for keeping the water bottles and uh, for that we have used the Algot planner which will show the number of items required and uh, finally the effective cost. So on the IKEA website uh, you can see an option which uh, helps us to design our own Algot system. For this I just have to type Algot in the search bar on IKEA homepage. Click on to Algot planner and it opens the design page which basically has uh, four parts the wall size parts and then finish first i click on start again to clear the previous design if there is any then i say start from scratch we have the option of fixing the wall size that is wall height and width but here i'm not going to do anything to this because here i'm going to design only a small system next i go to the size size of the wall upright we have three gap options that is a distance between the wall uprights i'm going to choose 40 centimeters then i also reduce the height i keep it this much so these are the two wall uprights next i go to parts in this i can add any part i have the option of shelves option of these baskets then i have option of other things like shoe organizer drying rack etc so here I have chosen only shelves. I opt for metal shelf because there is there are two types of shelves, wooden shelf as well as metal shelf. So I will choose uh, metal shelf. 
I have three options 18 cm depth, 38 cm depth and 58 cm depth. I select 18 cm depth and I drag this shelf and fix it here. Then I drag one more piece and fix it below that. Now the entire system is ready. There is two wall uprights, brackets and the shelves. This gives us the cost that is 1100 rupees. If I click on what's included, it shows the items in a tabular form. There is a two wall uprights, each 150 costing 300. Wall upright and their size and everything is given. Like wall upright 56 centimeters and two Algot shelves clearly shows that it is a metal and what color it is here it is white it uh, gives the width as 40 centimeters and depth as 18 centimeters and can withstand a maximum load of 10 kgs and each one costs 200 total of the Algot shelves is 400 then four brackets are used for the system two for each shelf and that makes it 400 so that's the total cost of the this storage uh, system comes to 1100 so now we can either uh, save this design or add to our shopping list in case we have logged in so it will show us where to find these items in the ikea stores so you can see how simple it is to uh, design your own uh, algot storage system using the algot planner so i'm sure you'll agree with me that algot is such a wonderful product I too am a great fan of Algot uh, storage system and I plan to add more such uh, organizing uh, solutions in, in my household. So as and when I uh, buy new products, I'll be uploading those videos. So keep watching out for those videos in my channel and thank you for watching.